In Machinery Minute, Agco Corporation introduced 15 new pieces of equipment yesterday that will be part of their new equipment lineup. Some of the equipment includes a new series of Heston Hay equipment, massive Ferguson combines, as well as a full complement of equipment for sunflower producers. It also unveiled equipment that will help with the gathering of biomass for biofuels. Ag Day had a crew in Kansas City for the event, and we'll bring you some of the highlights over the next few days. Meanwhile, at Minnesota's Farm Fest last week, we talked with the marketing rep for Rightway Manufacturing. That company was selling its big land rollers. Now, the rollers press rocks into the ground without rolling the crop out ahead of it. The company says the idea first originated in Saskatchewan, Canada. It all started in Saskatchewan in Canada for rolling peas. So what they do is they roll their beans either before or after they plant or corn on corn in front of the planter. What it does is for combinability. When you combine it, it saves on your equipment. That's a, it's a big investment for the farmers and that saves them, if they can save on sickle bars and other components, it's very helpful for them. It doesn't compact because it's less than five pounds per square inch, but what it does is it levels. So when you combine, especially in the fall if it's wet, you keep that head good and low, so you're gonna have minimum, minimal yield loss, which is a big benefit as well. Rightway offers land rollers that range from 8 to 85 feet wide. They come in three, five, or seven sections. The company says the rollers float independently while maintaining constant ground pressure so it works effectively even on changing terrain. In other news from Machinery Minute, Kubota is celebrating a milestone. The Japanese tractor maker says it has now sold one and a half million tractors in this country. Kubota first marketed its compact tractors in the U.S. in 1972 with a 12 horsepower machine. The company says it was the first to offer four-wheel drive on compact tractors. And 